I think if you're somebody in the podcast world and somebody is cool enough to put you on, put you in a position, then when you leave, you should not intentionally go out of your way to craft a bunch of lies about that person. And I think that when you look at what they did, like that's what they did. And they deserve the 22 sisters wrath for all of time for their behavior. Wrath. And like they, they should expect me to be enjoying it as they fail. So okay. it's like I, I'm narrating it publicly for the world. If I wasn't who I am, I would start a Danny from the Stop YouTube uh, channel and you know report on it on a daily basis. But instead, <laughs> I have to just drop truth bombs on you in the first ten minutes of the interview. Oh no, I love it. I love it because I was like doing this whole big th big three podcaster thing, but you took me in a different direction. And I think it, it is. I mean, it's like I remember after they left, you were initially. I don't know if this was genuinely true to how you felt at the time. You kind of looked like you didn't want to go in too much. Like you was trying to be like mm. more understanding, more reflective, more pensive. And now it's like, hey, let's rip the band-aid off. F these guys. <laughs> I mean, I think like I was kind of affected by the fact that so many of the fans were bamboozled. And like so many of those fans have kind of like left comments and reached out to me and let me know that like, hey, I can't believe that we actually thought that these guys were next up. And I don't know, for a while, I started to actually believe that I was the problem. Okay. And now I realize that that is absolutely not the truth and that they, in fact, were the problem okay. and that they, in fact, made the bad decisions and stuff. I mean, the only real thing that you could give me in terms of, like, what I did wrong was just that I didn't nurture the egos of them as much as I possibly should have. You know, I thought that they would just like long-term understand that like how much I had done for them and that they wouldn't do the exact kind of thing that they did. And I was, I was let down to see that, but you know. All right. On the bright side though, I kind of see what you say about AD maybe not being a good creator. Um, but T-Rell I think is dope. 